Hello and welcome to the MBS Show, episode number 382. I am your host, Norman Sanzo, and well, we got a few news this week, surprisingly. <laughs> so, anywho, let's not dilly dally and let's get right into it. So, first news Twilight Sparkle sneaks into Cyberpunk 2077 cinematic trailer, yes. And as you guys can see, here she is. Like, this is it in the movie or the trailer, and it's there. Wow, surprising. Um, I got no idea what to say. And I think this one here is the main six? Or is it just Twilight again? So, you know, honestly, I got no idea how this slipped through and whatnot, but I think we may have some bronies at CD Project Red. Yay! Um, and this was kind of a while ago. I mean, um, E3 was, what, months and months ago. I, I don't really remember when was E3. But it seems that Twilight snuck into Cyberpunk, so that's cool. Other than that, nothing much really. Um, you can go check the trailer for yourself. Um, the first appearance of Twilight would be at the 46 second mark. So, <laughs> yay. And yeah, that, that was surprising. That was really surprising. <coughs> so let's head on to the next news. Next news is mm, new info about My Little Pony three part <coughs> <coughs> sorry um, three part series finale Pony Marathon starting in October six on Discovery Family. So it seems that we got a few news info about when um, season. 9 is going to end and it seems that there's going to be a marathon starting at 6 a.m. on October 6 and uh, it will conclude on October 12th so yeah it will be like the whole marathon um, I, I read through the <coughs> article and it seems that we're going to have <coughs> a lot of episodes going to air like they're going to start a 24 hour marathon till the 12th so we had like about um 200 give me a second here ignore some of the spoilers or whatnot okay so it seems that we have about 221 episodes so yeah like they're gonna show all 221 that's gonna be surprising really really surprising and yeah that will be cool. <laughs> Woo. That's going to be a lot of uh, pony episodes. My goodness. So anywho, let's head back to a bit local. Well, not really local, but next to my border, Singapore. <coughs> so it seems that um, McDonald's of Singapore is going to have some pony and transformer toys. And Transformers Cyberverse, that's something that they did. And it's kind of okay. I've I seen some of it. It's really interesting. And they have ponies. Uh, and this is the same ponies that is in Europe right now. It's not all eight of them, but this is just the four. Um, they're not getting Applejack, Twilight, Starlight, and also Spike. Which is kind of a downer. Hmm. So anywho, um, Singapore's gonna have Rainbow Dash, Pinkie Pie, Rarity, and also Fluttershy. That's interesting. And other than that, there's not much info, um, except for the dates. Um, yeah, uh, it's gonna start on September 12th to the 18th, and it's um, when was this again? Calendar? Yes, 15. Um, yeah, it's already on. So if you're in Singapore. And you want to get your Transformers slash Pony toys, do it now. Because you have a few more days till it passes. That sucks. <coughs> <coughs> then, um, yeah, let's not go to the last news. And last news is, um, Big Jim did... <coughs> oh my god, sorry. Uh, Big Jim did a AMA on Twitter. And people asked a few stuff about him about the show and whatnot. This is a really interesting read that I recommend you guys going 
go in and read but I'll just highlight some of the few things that I noticed that were cool or awesome so uh, a person asked were there any plans to do another Power Pony episodes after the Avengers movie skyrocketed I thought Hasbro would be more than welcome to do another one Weirdly, no, they wanted the Power Ponies initially because they wanted to do them as a toy line. But then it took almost two years for that to happen. So, yeah. You can see how Hasbro wants to do their thing. <coughs> then here's another one. Um, Where did the idea for pairing Trixie and Starlight Glimmer came from? It just works out. Sorry, it just works. But I would never have thought about it before. No, s sorry, uh, about it before. No second princess. We like the idea of the two former baddies trying to be friends. We have no idea it would work as well as it did. I think a lot of credit is due to. Uh, Sher Kel Katie Sheridan and also um, Kathleen Barr for Kathleen Barr's amazing chemistry together. Yay! <coughs> then there was one. Where are the rest of the zebra, Jim? <laughs> we pitched the idea to Hasbro, but they weren't keen on exploring it. We always joked they were in. Uh, Girafrica. <laughs> oh god. So yeah, there's a lot of cool questions and answers here and I would recommend that you go in and just read through. Ah, here's one. My daughter is at ASU studying digital media and working on a degree in animation. What advice would you have for a young artist that wants to enter the profession keep drawing and don't let a rejection deter you from trying it can be hard to break in so don't give up so yeah this this is this are cool this 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 are cool like where I, I can't see enough just go in and read it and just enjoy it like those are some really good q and a's and with that that's the news <coughs> So, in this week, um, next topic is going to be what have I been doing with my week, and you know, honestly, nothing much. I haven't been getting well with this cough that I'm having. I was getting well, but it came back, and one of the few reasons is that Malaysia is currently experiencing some haze. For you guys, got no idea what haze is it's where there is a lot of smoke in the air where um where <coughs> multiple reasons could have happened um trash fires forest fires uh, or whatever it is pollutes the air and we get very bad <coughs> very bad air po air pollution yeah that's the word like long story short haze is just air pollution oh boys so yeah <coughs> i can't stop coughing and you know, honestly i'm asthmatic my inhaler so yeah um, trust me it is not fun um but some of the good thing is that I live in the southern part of Malaysia, which is in Johor, and we're not hit that hard like in the capital, which is Kuala Lumpur. And yeah, um, over there, you can't even see the skyscrapers, like the most popular one, the Petronas Twin Towers. Yeah, you can't even see that if you live like what a mile away or whatever it is that's how bad the weather is <coughs> and thank i'm thankful that i live in the southern part for this situation but still it is bad 
like we are affected too and for reasons that is beyond my comprehension is why didn't I go out with a mask yeah should have gone out with a mask but still for you guys who are local or experiencing the haze I would highly recommend going out with at least a mask to cover your face when you go out in the open and I don't mean go getting a surgical mask like this doctors no 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 uh, go get something that has a filter um, I, I think what uh, any hardware shop or the, the Mr. DIY has them so yeah just when you go out put a mask on and drink a lot of water because you get dehydrated with the weather right now because it's just heaty it's really hot so that's my tip for you guys other than that um oh games i played river city girls that was a fun game man <coughs> so saw some youtubers play it <coughs> and it seems like fun bought it on steam for what 51 ringgit um I i'm guessing if you convert that to dollars that would be what almost twenty dollars probably ah twelve dollars thirteen dollars maybe fifteen on steam i don't remember so yeah bought the game was really happy with it and yeah i, I just said i'm really really happy with the game uh, other than that mm, nothing much um <laughs> i finished the game in a short while but to get that one last achievement for me is finish the game with two players and since i'm a solo guy i don't have a partner to play with so that sucks but <laughs> i'm sure i can find someone uh just gotta install the game on my pc and let's try it yep but anywho um that's the news for this week and that's the session so well if you guys have any questions concerns or suggestions for the show you can contact us at themitshowgmail.com you can also reach us on the twitters the show's twitter account is at MBS show and my personal twitter account is at the <laughs> at norman sanzo also please subscribe and rate us on itunes youtube don't forget to press the bell icon to stay up to date and also stitcher radio and also like our facebook page uh, you can also catch us on com. links are in the show notes also please subscribe to the review and discussion podcast on itunes and stitcher radio over there, you'll catch me, Silver Quill, Sacred Heart Songs, and also Torterra, reviewing the Pony episodes, comics, and also specials. We also like to do other things than ponies, and one of those things are animes. Little Witch Academia is one of those things that we are doing right now, so if you like that, come join in. If you'd like to support the show, you can do so at patreon.com slash show. With every support, you get a week's early access to review discussion podcasts, exclusive and deleted content. And also a huge thank you for me. Talking about thank yous, I would like to thank Amy, Lucky Knight, myself, like Tristan, and also Jeffrey. Thank you so much, guys. You are great. So anyway, I have been Norman Sanzo, and I'll guys catch you next week with a, another fun episode of the BS Show. See ya.